Like, like, uh, oh, good shot, though. Good hook. So Prasovich, who's never lost a fight, goes down for, I believe, the first time in his career. Let's see how he handles adversity as a Coley will look to finish here in round three. Yo, Coley's just looking to lay that big one now because he knows he can hurt it. I think some variation with that backhand as well wouldn't go amiss. You know, bring the right uppercut up. But at times, Prasovich does fall over the front foot, come square on like we've touched on Roy and would be a good shot where he's the taller man to bring the right uppercut into play. Roy, when you've got a guy who's as tall and long as a Coley with that left arm right in your face, what's the best way to get around it and land those shots you want to? Well, you got to go either to the outside left or the outside right. You can't stay in the middle. And you can't stay directly to the left because he'll turn that shoulder around a little bit further. He still can reach you. He's tall. Like right there. If he just throws the right hand right there, Prasovic still coming straight down the pipe. You can't do that. Yeah, he has to step off the line. Yes, all the caller has to do is take one step back and throw a bomb, and he'll hit Prasovic every time. I mean, on the flip side here, how, you know, how does Prasovic try and put a dent into the Coley? You know, as he steps into range, he's, uh, he's open to get caught with the right hand, but I guess for him, he has to try and find hooks of his own. Yeah, he does, but the problem is he's, wait, he's waited too long. Oh, body shot. Body shot to the rib cage, oh. and that'll be a second knockdown. He might not recover from this one. I don't get up. Are you afraid of the power now, too? He might not get up at all. And that is it. Lawrence Okoli delivers the sauce here in London.